Sustainability. To almond growers in the Central Valley of California, it's not just a buzzword, it's how we've worked for decades. For the almond community, sustainable almond farming relies on production practices that are economically viable and based on scientific research, common sense, and respect for the environment, neighbors, and employees. Each year, the Almond Board of California invests more than $2.5 million to research production and environmental issues, such as pest management, water efficiency, and bee health. Almond growers, you know, certainly are very data-driven, are very research-oriented, and with that, have been quite willing to try new things based on where the science takes them. And that willingness to keep innovating, to keep trying, is part of the reason why I think we have such a successful industry. Jim Jasper's family started growing almonds in the 1950s. In the decades since, ongoing research has led to many production advancements. We started water conservation on that first drought. Um, we converted everything in 76 and 77 that we were farming to sprinklers, and then we've gone from impact sprinklers down to micro sprinklers. Over the past two decades, almond growers have reduced the amount of water used per pound of almonds by 33%. Innovations in irrigation, solar power, tree nutrition, pest management, and even hybrid vehicles have helped make the almond industry an agricultural success story. When we look at irrigation management, um, we now have data that over 70% of the growers are using micro-irrigation systems. Over, I think, 82, 83% are using some combination of weather, soil, plant water status to determine when and how much to irrigate. From irrigation to bee health to pest control, growers have taken new approaches and efficiencies aren't limited to water use. To reduce impacts on the environment, crop consultant Wes Asai takes a methodical approach to bee health and pesticide use. We know a lot more about insects and diseases. We know a lot more about their life cycles. We know about what temperatures they thrive at, um, what time they're mating, how long the eggs take to hatch. Things like that make it a lot easier to precisely time any treatments that are necessary. By continuously improving, adapting new technologies, and trying new methods based on research, California's almond growers will continue to meet consumer demand for nutritious, wholesome almonds in a responsible way. We're pretty proud of, of what we're doing here, and we continue to do more, and uh, hopefully we can uh, be here for a much, much longer time. <laughs>